Namaste everyone. Today I'm going to talk about Saturn in the 12th house. Now I've met a lot of people with this aspect and every time I come across with people with this aspect, they say that they feel like they are hopeless. Okay, like life, they can't see beyond their situation, they can't see beyond the present. They also have this aura of hopelessness surrounding them and every time they explain their situation, they're always talking about um, being homeless or having a fight with a family member or having a very very tough like the toughest childhood I'm talking about I'm talking about abuse I'm talking about severe abuse and a very very hard hard past now the people that I've met with Saturn in 12th house barely have anybody to help them or if anybody Saturn in 12th house makes the person very humble okay because they know what it is not to have anybody they know what it is to struggle and be hopeless so whenever they see someone in a similar situation that they were prior or that they are in, um, they can sympathize with that person. Now I've had Saturn transit my 12th house and I can tell you something, it is worse than a Saturn return, okay? When Saturn hit the first degree of, of Libra, that was several years ago, um, it was a very, very hopeless time for me. I couldn't see beyond the future. All the friends that I had in the 11th house were gone because there was another generation. They had their own life now. They had their own family. They had their own new friends. They had new jobs. So we couldn't keep in touch. So I lost all the people in the 11th house. And then when Saturn came into the 12th house, he came to teach me another lesson. Okay. A lesson to be humble, a little, and a lesson to be completely alone. What I learned with Saturn transiting my 12th house was that I learned to be my own guide. I learned to be my own, my own helper. Okay, when I had Saturn in the 12th house, I was I connected more with the ethereal side of life. Okay, I connected more with spiritual guides. I connected more with the esoteric because that's the only thing that I had. I didn't have people that understood me during that phase. Okay, so the only thing that I could rely on was on the esoteric, was in researching the esoteric, was in learning about my spiritual guides, was in learning about my angels okay and contacting them and asking them you know for help you know being more faithful I had to rely on faith to get through that faith and I think that is the life theme and the lesson of people who have Saturn in the 12th house and it is to have faith and to rely on your own self okay during this time and not to be not to play the victim too much because usually when we have that aspect we tend to ask ourselves oh why me you know why did this happen to me why is this person treating me this way and sometimes they don't even have mercy on you but I think what this aspect is teaching, okay, the person in a karmic level is that you have to, you have to connect with the ethereal, okay? Everything is not always physical, all right? And you have to connect with your higher self to get you through this phase, to get you through this lifetime that you have this aspect. And that is the lesson, okay? You have to learn the other side of the wheel, okay? Maybe in the other life, you were too physical, you were too reliant on people around you to help you, but you never relied on the spiritual world, okay? You never had faith. And what this aspect is teaching you is, is to be patient. It is also teaching you serenity. And when I had this aspect, I learned how to build my own um, spiritual sanctuary, okay? And that's where I regrouped all my thoughts. And that's how I organized myself and that's how I gained the strength, okay? And I think that's what people with Saturn in the 12th house should do, okay? they should create a window in that fortress because that's what it is, a fortress. They can't get out, all right? But at least they should make a window, okay? And create some sort of comfort within that aspect. Once you learn how to accept this aspect and, and you incorporate it as just a part of your life, you will be able to defeat it, okay? Just like Bruce Lee said, um, once you become the disease, the disease disappears. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope that it brought you a lot of light, you know, within that 12th house, okay, where Saturn lies. And I hope you could connect with the spiritual world and I hope it could assist you. So have a wonderful day.